Last week Congress put squarely on the table the question of whether the health of our democracy requires renovation of our colleges and universities. I believe the answer to that question is, yes. On Tuesday, the House Education and Workforce Committee held a hearing to investigate how Harvard University, MIT and the University of Pennsylvania are responding to anti-Semitism on their campuses. The hearing's viral moment came when Rep. Elise Stefanik, R.N. Y. asked a chain of questions that resulted in the three university presidents saying that if someone urged the genocide of Jewish people, that merely might, depending on the context, be a violation of campus policies against bullying and harassment. Two of the three presidents, Harvard's Claudine Gay and Penn's Liz Magill, issued apologies or clarifications, and Magill has now resigned.